what's your leadership style as CEO of your own organization, Center for Advancing Leadership and Human Potential? What's leadership like for you? What makes a good leader? Um, I, I think there's so much wrapped up in that. Uh, first, I think to the degree that I'm successful at all in this role or other roles, it's because I, I think I, I know myself well, or I'm at least interested in exploring who that person is, and trying to constantly think about what do I bring to the table and what am I really passionate about. So the work that I'm doing now is, is my life. That It resonates so deeply with my personal mission that I think it gives me a lot of energy and motivation as a leader. And I think people you're working with can detect that, you know? Like, wow, she's really jazzed about this work. And, and I think it gets them excited too. So I think that's a key component of being effective as a leader. And then I think also personally, I think there, there's this sort of, and, and maybe it's a false dichotomy, but it's one that I've experienced to some degree. People will either want to focus on the task or goal, right? Let's just focus on that or the people. Like I'm a people person or I'm a goal person. And I think, uh, I, I certainly have my natural tendencies there, as do most people, but I think it's really important to balance both of them. I think you can't lose sight of the vision or where you're heading or you just kind of run in circles or, or not very efficient. But at the same time, if you're doing anything that requires you know, people beyond just yourself, you need people on board. They're absolutely critical. And so I think just trying to think about as a leader how to balance those things, especially in really tough situations when maybe you don't have enough time or resources and you know something's coming up, how to do that well, that's something as a leader that I really try to, try to prioritize.